Okay, here's a really quick one for you. How to implement the simplest search possible in App Inventor. Um, here's the results here, and I have a number of records in this list, uh, and there are more underneath as well. Basically, it's aeroplane call signs and types and so on. So, all I need to do is to click in my search list box here, and for example, if I want to know uh, records with the word Oxford in, I just start typing and off it goes. It starts looking up and there's all three records with Oxford. If I want to know which records have uh, Cessna in, and I've got those there, or there's a Piper Warrior, which is another one. Simplest search possible, fantastic and dead easy to do. Okay, all you need to do to implement this is uh, use a list view uh, which you can see over here, you drag over the list view. Um, the screen, you need to make sure scrollable is off um, because the list view itself is scrollable and it can cause conflicts. Just do that. You'll see that list view has something called elements from string. Well, you just simply code that inside the blocks itself and this is how you'd set it up. So in the blocks here, as you can see, all I've done when the screen is initialized is set the elements from string for list view one to a whole bunch of records each one of those separated by a comma that's really important for list view and list picker that records are separated by commas and that's what I've done the thing that you need to implement to make the search engine search work properly in designer um, is the show filter bar here that show filter bar switches on this search thing here which does all the search searching for you the other thing to be careful of is that in your record itself here in the data that they're searching that there are spaces clear spaces between each of the items you want to search if you have separators it won't work so if I were to put like in fact uh, there is separators on the bottom one here so if I go back into my um, search you'll see that there are two records with the word Piper in but actually if I search for Piper only one of them will appear so let's just show you that now so let's have a look first of all for the two records there's the Piper Tomahawk and there's the Piper Warrior and if I search for Piper only one turns up and that's the Piper Warrior that's because of that colon separator which you'll see is in there so whilst colon separators are useful um, for delineating fields in a record. For example, here I've got a call sign as a first field, and the Cessna 172, that whole thing is the next field rather than just the name of the aircraft, it's the aircraft type as well. Uh, similarly, for the name of the location and the date, I might want to separate those out as fields, in which case I would use a separator like that, and that's something I'm going to show you later on in another tutorial but for now if you want the simplest tutorial uh, sorry the simplest search engine possible this is how you do it it's dead easy and good luck